Hey baby dolls, it's me Monique and welcome to my boutique. And so today we are going to be talking about my love, Santi Alley, aka the Garment Dis District in LA. If you don't know anything about Santi Alley, go ahead and start Googling Santi Alley and you will see exactly what I'm talking about. Of course, darling, there's Rodale Drive and there's The Grove and there's Melrose, but... If you've never been to Santee Alley, you are really missing out. Of course, I I went to Rodeo Drive, Beverly Hills, all that kind of good, good stuff. And I had a fabulous time, darling. Yes, I did. But Santee Alley was very thrilling as well. Santee Alley is basically a place where you go and you get clothes, you get sunglasses, you get hats, perfumes, T-shirts, every makeup, everything, purses, dresses, everything imaginable for like a dollar to five to ten dollars. Okay, so it's like they're just giving the stuff away. It's a madhouse. It's a festival. It's like it's a flea market, and it's just it's like probably about maybe a mile or so of just vendors, street vendors, stores, street food, tacos, hot dogs everything it's just it's so fun check out a video that i did around this time last year where i'm actually my husband is filming me in the santee alley we did a little bit of filming this year and again i'm going to try to get that video together for you but i really wanted to get this haul out to you guys and so let's go ahead and get into um what i found now i will be honest with you this year i didn't really have as much time as i wanted to have for sent for santi alley uh, because it was on the day that i actually went to beauty con beauty con was an amazing experience and i've got a haul video for beauty con as well and so i was only able to shop at santi alley for about an hour and a half or so but i think i did pretty good so anyway let's show you one of the little bags i love la Alright, and so the first item I want to show you is this really amazing skirt. It originally came from Rue, uh, actually Forever 21, so it's got a Forever 21 tag. And this is a long, long, long skirt. And it hugs your curves, it goes all the way down to the ground. It is so beautiful. And um, it's just a beautiful tie-dye design. And so, yeah. The thing about Santee Alley, also I'm going to tell you, they may have a price on something, right? You never give them what they are asking. They ask for $7 for this skirt, okay, which we, it's great material, great fabric. They asked for $7. I got in my purse and I said, here's $5. Would you like to sell it to me today? And she looked at her co-worker and she said, thank you. Put it in a little bag for me, and I got this skirt for $5, brand new. It is so L.A. I love it so much. So, yeah. Love it. Same thing. Um, I wanted a really, really long see-through beach dress. And, you know, all these boutiques in Beverly Hills and things were wanting like $50 and $60 just for something, you know, mediocre, right? I got this, and not even $50, $60. Actually, that was at BeautyCon. They said $50 or $60. Actually, in Rodale Drive, they were wanting like $200 for this. Please. I got this long, beautiful beach dress. And it's really long. Okay, this is what it looks like. Okay. See that? It's very see-through. Very long. I got this. For seven dollars. Okay, the guy had thirteen dollars on it, and I was like, I would have paid thirteen dollars, but I was in a actually here, no, he had fifteen dollars on it, and I would have paid fifteen dollars because come on, it, that's a steal, right? But yeah, I got this for seven dollars, and I love it, and it is just so cute. And they are wearing these in L.A. on the beach with their swimsuits underneath it, what have you. And it's just so, I love it. Look at this, and look at the fabric. The man that sold it to me, he was from Morocco. And he was telling me that actually what 
people are doing in these boutiques are they're cutting off the tags and then they're getting other tags sewn on to the garment like say made in Paris, Chateau Lou, uh, Chateau Lou or um, some kind of French name or whatever. Just, you know, they're basically telling a lie and selling these for like, you know, $100 and stuff. Crazy, right? So yeah, I got that. $7. All right, also, I got some imitation turquoise. This is the imitation turquoise necklace. And I love, love, love turquoise. And then I got another imitation turquoise one. This one has the white beading. Okay. So I got these. These were normally $25, which that's crazy. I got these for $2 each. Now, they have a lot of different costume jewelry stores there. And you can get stuff for a dollar, which I'm going to show you. But um, I was willing to pay $2 for this because it's a good quality. And if anything, you know, the beads are worth that, right? All right, so I got those. And then also, in Santi Alley. Like I said, I only had about an hour and a half this time. Normally, I'm there for like five or six hours. But um, I got two packages of these bracelets. Now, you know these bracelets are normally in the higher end stores. And you could get these for like $10. I paid $1 for these bracelets. Is that not amazing? So yeah, I just got two sets and I'm going to double it up like that. Double them. $2 for all of these bracelets. So crazy. And then last but not least, I just had to get something that I thought represented me in LA. And I got a cute little headband for a dollar. Let's go ahead and put it on. My husband really didn't like it that much, but I think it's going to be cute with the right summer dress, with the right little hairstyle. Yeah, one dollar. Love it. So anyway, that concludes my Santee Alley Los Angeles vacay haul. Remember that pretty is as pretty does, and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.